Hello folks, welcome back to the Vertigo Tea Party and let's play the World of Warcraft. Today's episode is brought to you by Asger. Thank you very much Asger for your continued support on Patreon. I very much appreciate it. So we're actually, we are still planning on doing an uh, instance. In fact, we're going to queue up as soon as we get to where we're going. But uh, I'm actually heading over here because I do want to take a look at this Isle of Watchers. Given that it's an island, like off on its own, I'm guessing there's probably a special quest, or maybe when you hit 110 or something like that, that's when you're supposed to go over. But I was trying to figure out how to do this, uh, because we'll probably have to queue for a while since we are DPS, and DPS are a dime a dozen. So uh, I thought we'd go check that out while we're in the queue, and obviously if we still haven't got our group when we get over there, or if it's blocked or something like that, then we will just, uh, I'll just cut it. Uh, we don't want a random dungeon. We want a specific dungeon. Uh, eyes of, Eye of Ashara, 98 to 110. That's weird that's green though. Why is that green and this one yellow? Maybe because, I don't know. Anyway, uh, let's make sure that's the one we need. Take that off. Is it the right button? We need this one, and we need this one. So, yeah, damn it. I have a Shara, yep. Fine group. All right. Ahem. Make sure I was marked as DPS. How long do you think? Nine minutes? Not too awful, but not uh, not great either, honestly. That's okay, though. I'm not, not too worried about it. I'd rather go in stress-free, well, relatively stress-free as a DPS, than go in as a uh, healer and... You know, mess it all up, which I almost certainly would. And of course, we're gonna stop for herbs along the way. Because yeah, again, let's be honest, if you're DPS, like unless you're doing like auto attack DPS, nobody's probably gonna notice, at least not in leveling up dungeons. If you're in heroics, something like that, yeah, they're probably gonna notice. Because I imagine you have to be max level to get into heroics. I think there's even gear, gear level checks, I think, on that. I could be wrong, but I think that is the case. Wow, what's so much? We found like more herbs in the first five minutes than we have in the entire uh, time we've been here, I feel like. Nah, not gonna waste time. Do I just not have. I must not have my fear down here. Which is annoying, but. Yeah, I keep finding this place is too. Like, there's some areas where these mobs are just like max, like 110, okay? I'd have no idea why. It's so weird. Like, I, I actually ran into that before, where, like, I was messing around, and, like, I noticed I was starting to attack an enemy. I was like, God, I'm taking a shitload of damage. Why is that? And, like, I noticed the mob was 110. I'm like, what? I was like, why is this 110? There seems to be a lot of unexplained stuff in, in WoW now, where they're just kind of, like, assuming. What? Why did it? What? I didn't decline it. I just... What? I just resurrected. Thank you. Uh, let's go ahead and heal up. Not that it matters. Uh, I would like to get somewhere safe-ish. There we go. All right. Uh, yes. Sure. Uh, I don't really need that. Ahem. I must have it locked. That's fine. Whatever. Heal myself up. Don't want to make the healer do it. Where's our tank? He's F2. Yes, he is. Oh, we can uh, mount here. That's nice. Oh, that's what I was going to... I was trying to remember what I was going to do. Now I remember. I was going to... Um, uh, fix my... Uh, situation with the uh, keys target him and then assist power I realize we have our uh, Void thing up, but I wanted to wait till the next start of the next fight. Oh, actually, I didn't see that other one there. My bad. Yeah, I, uh, I definitely need to fix that damn 
issue with the they will not get far. Go ahead now, we'll go void eruption. That big AE going on there. I think part of the problem is the the name pads are are like they're so like they're just hard to see. I need to definitely need to fix that. I'm just selecting him to uh and heal up both of those guys, I think. Or uh heal. Jesus Christ. Sorry, I'm just trying to focus. So much random shit going on. Alright. Didn't really need Vampiric Touch. Damn it. Damage is poo poo. I'm sure. So if you had nothing but priests in your party, could they just chain shield? I feel like they could. I want to get all of it on them there. Damn it. We're getting my damn keys. It's all right. We'll get ever in a situation like this. I always start fucking all my shit up. Ah, we meet again, weakling. This now guy I know is part of the quests. You. Oh yeah, this is the guy who ran away from, uh, what's his face? We were getting close, so I'm gonna kind of get over here too. I'm assuming that's necessary. Make your mind flay is back up. Go ahead and dot her, I guess. Get behind someone, okay? Nowhere to hide. Then do a thing on him. I don't know if that actually helps. I'm just used to healing now, so I'm like, I want to heal this guy. Oh, let's do our nukes. We'll do our AE as well, since that does a lot of damage. Why would I want to get behind someone if they're going to be, uh, if I'm going to be impaled? That doesn't make a hell of a lot of sense. God, my damage is terrible. All right, we supposed to get anything from him? No, that's from Lady something, I think. But we did get that kill credit, obviously. hate that shit. Like, something about the click on that, uh, makes it keep thinking that I'm clicking the say thing instead of the tab. I must I think I have got them overlapped. I use it so rarely that I, like, when I, it happens, I don't think to fix it. Or, uh, like, in between, like, when I get a chance to. Oh, wait, this, uh, AE. I'm gonna do Mind Flay too to get damage done on those guys. Maybe I can at least get a little bit of uh, decent damage stuck in here. I just saw something back there. I was like, I'm not gonna fuck with that. Looks like it's a non hostile mob, but nope. Might as well shield him up. Even though, obviously, my shield's not gonna protect him a whole lot.
Why even add all these trash mobs, like, at this point? Like, when you know damn good and well everybody's gonna skip them. What's the point? I think we got a bunch of ads, yeah. So let's throw this down. Mind flay to get some damage in on them. Oh shit. I was gonna say, that looks bad, whatever that is. I was gonna use my weapon, why not? Fucking snail, really? Dealing with snails? That, uh... That truly the might of the Legion is in the snails? Oh, here's the Lady Hate Coil that we need. Continue the ritual! I will handle these fools! Will you? It is possible I'm gonna hang out by the Shaman. Oh shit, I don't want to be in the water. Noted. The waters rise! Doing this for the AE. Get redo the dots. Oh shit. Go in the our dark form here. No, I thought I thought that that thing like that was showing me how to instant cast was like uh, the wrong the other something else. Get that weapon in right before it drops. No Come on, get that insanity up. Come on, keep it up just a little bit longer. Shit. The waters rise. That was a bad time to use my AE because right as they're coming up. I like fart my brain's farting here. It's like, oh shit, what do I use next? God, I'm glad I practiced because this would be even worse. Yeah, I keep seeing that thing over my head uh, as the indicator, and I keep thinking, oh shit. They come for you. Keep thinking like, oh shit, I've got to um I gotta move. Something's coming towards me. Did we get that from her? We did we did get it. I get when we got her Oh, so we got the lens. Oh, okay, now we gotta kill the wrath thing. Alright. Serpentrix. He sounds scary, right? Got a bunch of shit in. Oh. AE. Oh, god damn it. I should also be fucking doing that uh, AE thing I've got that does the AE stun. Fuck. Jesus. There's not enough goddamn poison around. What's up with us getting knocked backwards here recently? That's happening a lot. I feel like. It's not interrupting our casting. Which is a bit strange. Want to stand in the fucking shit, make his job easier or harder, rather. Let's use vampiric touch. Get some free healing in here. Damn it! Oh, well, there's multiple ones of them now, right? That's weird. Yeah? Sorry, I can't really, like, think and talk while I'm like, trying to actually sort of do my, my duty here. And duty. Alright, let's try to keep insanity up as much as we can. I feel like that's also what these, uh, these nukes are for. Shit. Nope, God damn it! not me. I, I, <laughs> I really want to change that key. Whoa, where the fuck did he go? Jeez. 
Jesus fucking Christ. No, I want to target him and assist. Yes, thank you. And shield him up. I'm going to heal myself. A little bit. Take, God damn. Can't even attack him from all the goddamn shit. Well, that was sloppy as balls. Oh, he's resident. No, I'm not gonna. I need. Where the hell's the. Oh, probably over here. Thinking just in case there's something I needed off of him. That's trying to help with the healing. Side healing duties. Since our damage is so fucking terrible. Wrath of Ajar, we still need... Oh, yeah, we actually both quests need Wrath of Ajar. Nice. Damn! That crit, though. Damn it, I shielded myself. God damn it. Um. Our friendship is over, what? Is he a paladin? Yeah. Board paladin is still just weird. God damn it. I'm so used to using shield on myself as for a speed boost. God damn it. By the time I'm targeting them dying. Yeah, I like. I need to just use function keys. I used to use function keys all the time to target uh, party members, and I just fell out of the habit. I need to get back into it. Like, it's so much easier than uh, even clicking on them just to hit a function key, especially when the tank is F2. Like, that's very easy to consistently hit. I like that this instance or this area has a lot of non-hostile creatures, too, because, like, it's just, like, it's always weird that every instance you go to, everything is hostile. And a lot of times it makes sense. But it's nice to have a little change once in a while. As far as that goes. Oh no, I wanna... Dot the... Oh, really? Dot the other one. I actually don't have a ton of hit points. Man, my damage is so bad. King Deep Beard. I thought I said King Neckbeard for a second. Get the pet out. I'm gonna keep my, um. No, not that jackass. I'm gonna. I was trying to say was I want to keep my um, vampiric embrace. Oh, until now, actually. Now we're going to do it. Get that extra damage in. Gonna nuke the shit out of him to get some healing in there. Ah, God damn it. Use my weapon a little bit too fucking slow. Just don't want to shield randomly on the dude man over there.
All right, next. Oh, is this? Oh, God. Yeah, I'm going to guess this is the Wrath of Azara. Holy shit. I'm going to heal myself. No need for him to have to do that. Yeah, somebody asked the DPS meter, and then I was like, I'm not going to post it. I'm not going to in, uh, infringe myself here. But somebody did put. Oh, shit. I guess I don't want to be near people on that. Looks like it's one of those, uh, you are the bomb type things. But nobody really said anything like, oh yeah, you fucking suck. Come on. Ah, oh, god damn it. Oh, I'm, I'm like, why can't I cast? <laughs> Get into the water, little fish man. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Again, I'm gonna assume I don't want to be near people when this is going off. Oh shit. I can't see. Fuck. I'm gonna guess that's not Bueno to get hit by. I'm gonna get over here so I don't get hit by it. I, don't have a target. I was going to, uh... I was going to go into super form, but these things are dying fairly quick. No point in wasting it, really. I kinda don't want to be in the water after that last one. Oh shit, it's what it's a uh, water Ragnaros. I nice, low on health, I like that already. There's an interesting mechanic here too that it keeps like moving me around. Because I'm not, it's not me just like randomly wanting to move around here. Come on. Ah, God damn it. I was trying to use these uh, power word voids. Tempest. To uh, stay in void form. Like near the end. Uh, man, sometimes my brain just fucking locks up. Like, it's just like, I don't, I don't know how to cast. I don't know how to do things. Oh my god. Jesus Christ, could there be more visual bullshit going on here? Oh my god, seriously. Fucking hell. I don't know if that's from stun or what. My god, there's so much visual just nightmare going on here. Holy balls. At least we finished our quests. Jesus, like I couldn't see what's going on. It's like a like a storm almost, you could say. Tide zone stuns whole and unprotected. Now that you have defeated Queen Azara's wrath and have the tide zone, it's time to place it in the portrait room. Okay, cool. Oh, no, I was like, uh, shit. Where's it going? Oh, cool. We got the uh, item. Whoa! No, thank you. Way too much crit loss. I don't even know what twist of faith is.
I have no idea what he's saying, but I'm just going to say thanks. Yeah, I don't, he said uh, you. Uh, let me go back. I don't even see what he said. I mean, we're only going to go back to disc after this. But uh, I do want to see. Use Twist of Faith and Legacy of the Void. I don't even know what. Oh, I bet they're talents. No. Legacy of the Void. Well, that's an expansion for... Oh, there it is. Void Eruption may be cast any time your Insanity level is 65 or higher, and Void Form increases Shadow Damage dealt. Oh, wow. We... Oh, that's pretty nice. Holy shit. I mean, obviously... Well, no, I was going to say you can't use it as much. But I figure, like, with this, the Shadow of the Void gives you a lot of Insanity. So, go into that form, and then if it starts to get low, use these faster casting Shadow Word Voids to stay in Shadow form. See, I mean, that's, you know, I always complain about, oh god, I don't want to do pugs. But, you know, to be fair, most of the people I feel like we've grouped with have either been neutral, like they just don't even talk, or they just don't care, or they've actually, in this case, like he was like trying to be helpful. Like, he was, like, trying to be like, hey, here's a way to, to do better. Uh, what's the other thing he said? Use Twist of Fate. I'm trying to find it. We might die again. I don't really care. I just want to get out of here. Uh... We might stay this spec some more. I don't know. We'll see. There it is. I think I see it. Twist of Fate is what he meant. Oh, for God's sakes, fuck off. Yeah, apparently not, because this is like the one place that's level 100. And I can't... I misplaced my fear. That's annoying. But yeah, it, like I started to say before, we got into the instance. I feel like there's a lot of things in WoW, like they just assume that you know what's going on. Like this, like why is there random areas when everything's supposed to scale to your level? Why is there these random ass areas where everything's at, like max level? Who knows? Like it doesn't tell you any of that. It just assumes that you probably know. Uh, I definitely like, I felt that a lot in some of these later expansions. It just assumes you know a lot of shit about what's going on, even when it's like patently clear that you might that you have no reason to assume that. Let's go to Dalaran. Where is this turning at? Oh god, I hope it's not in the fucking dungeon. I don't want to go back in there to turn in. Okay, is it the same place? Yeah, it looks like it is. So yeah, let's actually sweat those. We might try Shadow one more time. Um, fuck's sake, map. So Shadow Crash, I guess, isn't that good. I mean, it's a ton of damage, but it's only every 30 seconds. So, yeah, it's not that good. Uh, maybe it's good for solo, but maybe not so much for instances. Void Eruption, we cast any time, and Void Form increases Shadow damage by an additional 5. I mean, 5% is pretty weak, but... A uh, Twist of Faith. After damaging a target below 35% health, you deal 20% increased damage and 20% increased healing. Ah... See, now that seems like that would be good for that boss, obviously, because he was at below 35% health the entire time. However, I really like the Shadow Word Void for soloing. I mean, hmm. For bosses, this would obviously be good, right? Since bosses are going to hang below 35% health lower than your typical mobs. So I definitely see why he would suggest that. Very, very interesting. See? There's plenty of... What's his name? Argotius. Thank you, Argotius. Argotorius. Argotorius. Sorry. Oh, God. Uh, can I use outside? Please, let that fucking die. Oh, we're 30 minutes in and almost have enough for a level, but we're still going to wrap it up here. And again, like, even when they posted DPS meters, and I was obviously doing completely garbage. 
they weren't like, ah, oh, you fucking suck. One guy's just like, oh, I was getting lucky on the boss. All right, so let's turn this in. I'm gonna say at this rate, we might not even finish this third piece, but we'll maybe make some decent progress on it. Archimage Kangar has set us out of space here for the Tidestone of Golganeth, as well as the rest of the Pillars of Creation. Nice. Uh, oh shit, wow. Since I have seen the Tidestone hole, but there it stands. I and my people owe you a debt of gratitude that we can never repay. You could try. Please, you could try really hard. Turn to Azuna as soon as you can. There is much yet left to do. No, I'm pretty sure I knocked it all out, to be fair. I wonder if it if that means there's like new quests there or something. Where does that go? Wyrmrest Temple. Oh, okay, it's just some old places that you can go. Shatrath, Karazhan, wow. Dalaran Crater. Alright, let's go out and turn this other quest in. And we'll pick our next right point in the next video. Oh man, we're like so close. 10%? No, I wanna I wanna start that in the next video. I wanna start a new area in a new video. It'd be weird to go to a new area and then inst in the video instantly, even though I've probably done that before. Um I want this one. Wait, what? What? Wait, where is that? Oh, you idiot. Moron. It's in your class hall, you cretin. Jesus H. Christ, you're a fucking idiot. Damn. Yeah, I like... It's so weird when I get an instance. Like, I always... I guess say my brain, like, it doesn't... I don't want to say it doesn't matter. But, like, even, like, all that practice I did soloing and getting used to the, the order and when the cast what. Like, when I get an instance, all of a sudden my brain's like, uh... Like, what? It's so frustrating, because it's like, you know what to do. Like, you've been doing this for, like, two hours. Like, why in the shit can you not figure this out? Uh, victory in hand, you know there are still pillars of creation that must be recovered if the legions be defeated once and for all. Your order has identified uncharted regions of the Broken Isle that still house the remaining pillars. Looking over the information would help focus your next effort. Yeah, I know. I guess that's kind of another nudge to be like, hey, dumbass. Not all who want Gazing through the lens of a powerful Naga will allow you to witness my vision. You return it just in time, it would seem. Yalia and Zabra have just finished crafting the elixir. The lens would allow you to see what I see when the vision begins. I have everything I need to bring forth a vision, but the question remains, are you ready to witness it? Even the smallest glimpse into the future can weigh heavy on the soul. Once I ingest the elixir, the vision will come quickly. <laughs> Gazing into the lens of the tides will allow you to see what I see. Let me know when you're ready to begin. Oh, let's go ahead and do this. Maybe this will get us over. We're at like 7%. begin the ritual. Ritual being you drinking the potion and seeing crazy shit, apparently. Uh, we also have uh, at least one quest. Like, guild hall quest that I can do that. I think one of them is player experience, too. Use the lens of the tides, okay? Ahem. <clears throat> Oh. I see a great darkness looming over Netherlight Temple. The shadow of the Burning Legion, ready to strike. Our order will fall at his hands. Everyone within will perish. This will be our fate. We are doomed to die at the hands of the Dread Lord Balnazar. Ah, I think I remember this him from Warcraft 3. Will be our fate. Unless. A sweet, sexy disc. Sometimes Shadow Priest saves us all. Leads to our victory. You are there, walking with the light, guiding us all. It's becoming clear. An old enemy becomes an ally. Who the f oh God, the Scarlet Crusade. All unite. 
night under the light. Work complete. All right. We welcome your help. Do not let this demon determine our fate. You have the power to change our future. I have seen the path to salvation, and you will lead us there. I must retire for now. The weight of the vision has taken its toll on my mind and body. Uh, recruit a group of acolytes to accompany your champions on missions. 300 artifact power. Holy shit. You are the instrument of change. Damn it. Still no level. Oh, we got a lot of... Achievements. There's a summary. Hmm. All right. Oh, we got a bunch of quests here too. Nice. All right. Will this give us our experience? Go for the bonus chance. Oh, you son of a bitch! I'm at one percent. You. S oh no, we did level. We did level. Nice. 107. Just barely. Wow. What? How far are we in? Board, like, less than 5,000 experience. Awesome. Uh, let's go ahead and send our dudes out. Soul stealing. Follower XP. Player XP and artifact power. Um, Player XP makes me happy. Let's do with that. If not countered, curse will prevent bonuses loot from being won. Oh, well. I stand ready to help. We stand together. Well, it's funny is a lot of times the acolytes give a better chance. So like this one ten, one oh six, one oh seven. That's so weird to me. I guess it's to give you a reason to use up your resources. Oh no, but let's go ahead and send them out. Um, I'm not sure. No, she's out on a mission. Let's do this one, tip the scales. If we have an... Actually, we're not going to have enough. Wait a minute, we should have... Um, I thought I told you to bring in some new recruits, son. You sitting on your ass? Blessings upon What's the fucking deal? Jackass. Pretty sure I told him to do max last time. Anyway, we should have gotten this, though. Cannot recruit any more of the troop type. Ah, god damn it. I should have done that first. Shit, I'm a dumbass. I'm doing a lot of dumbass shit today. Um, tell you what, this last thing we do today. Let's switch specs back. I think I will try this twist of fate. Like I said, maybe not for solo, but I don't even know if I'm going to stay shadow for the next video. But and I would ask you guys feedback, but by the time you see this, I'll probably either be done uh, at 110. Or pretty darn close, because I'm recording pretty far in the future. Anyway, let's switch to Discipline. And we'll try it out. Make sure we have the right weapon equipped. I mean, the obvious negative doing this is that our Shadow Weapon, which is our basically our secondary spec at this point, is like really, really low, but uh, 300. Oh, yeah, this is gonna be hot. How far does he go? Oh my god, that's crazy! The best kind of crazy, the crazy that gives me powerful weapons. I like, I'm okay with that kind of crazy. All right, so let's see. So we've gotten that maxed out. I really hate that we've had to put points into this. I really don't like Radiance. Despite how often I end up using it. Um, I only need one more point and then we can get the power of the Dark Side. Which is awesome. Definitely want to get that. I might start focusing on missions that give... In that case, I might start focusing on missions that give... Uh, weapon power, because I want that, because it looks pretty dope. But, uh, anyway... We'll finally wrap it up. Thank you guys for watching. We're, we're making good progress. We're making good progress. I am saying about, on average, I'd say uh, three videos per level. It's been pretty close on a few of these. But overall, uh, I'd say we're doing pretty good. Next, um... Next, we'll probably go to a new area first. 
Well, no, actually, we'll probably get the qu these priest quests that popped up first, and then we'll decide on the new area that we're going to. There's only two left, so any, mini money, mo. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. Thanks again to Asger for your continued support on Patreon. Very much appreciate it. Make sure you guys like my videos if you like them. It does help me out a bunch. Comment, let me know what you're thinking of the series, and I'll see you next time.